I'm Julie Klausner. I'm here in Brooklyn to take a class on whiskey and woodworking along with my fellow devotee of education, Ted Leo. Julie, I love to learn. And how is your week producer, Spoonie, Chris Spooner? Julie, I slept outside of this place so I wouldn't be late. Let's go learn some stuff. Welcome to class. I'm Soma. Hi, Soma. Hello. Yes. Are you the teacher? I am the teacher. Mm. It's very sweet of you. Don't eat that. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you're sorry, so let's do it. Yes. We're doing. We're yes. learning now. Yes. That's what we're here to do. Uh, question. Yes. Um, I think that we would all feel comfortable if we were actually drinking the we whiskey while we were learning whiskey. about it. Uh, who wants nice. all for drinking while we're learning? Hands up. Okay. So the reason why whiskey is whiskey is because it has the flavor of whatever was put into it. And the things that are put into it are called the mash bill. He did the mash. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I, now I understand. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? So bourbon is 51% corn. It's that 1% that gets, allows it to name itself yeah. the thing that it it's is. Like, Everything's it's like Occupy company. Wall Street right. with Ted. <laughs> so rules about bourbon. There are no rules. <laughs> Bourbon doesn't even really have to be aged at all. They make a baby mm -hmm. bourbon that's only aged for three months. Okay. When do you no longer have the choice? Thank you. Thank you. What is yeah. what is this? I ordered what pizza. Is, good. This one's cheeseless. No cheese. All right. Sorry. Don't worry. There's enough yeah. for you. Nice. That's cool. I, there are only three pizzas there. Let's go. Anything is possible if you imagine near it. <laughs> What's the difference between Japanese whiskey and scotch? Bill Murray does ads for them. People drink whiskey at what? Sex things. Sex, yeah, that's how I would characterize really? it. Really? Well, yeah. wait a minute, wait a minute. There is a clinical thing called whiskey dick yeah. that I don't think would yeah, help much. Yeah, we have much questions about thing. whiskey dick. Yeah. What's the deal with it? The alcohol increases your serotonin levels. Mm -hmm. Bad news. So bears. basically, whiskey is the same thing as like those like prolong. What's that? Jello oh, like a... Uh, I'm sure. Hey, I'm it's, sure. Uh, it's yeah. uh, Sideshow Bob. Sideshow Bob's smiling because he's got a hard dick. Right? So moving extends. on. That's extends. Now that makes it longer. I'm talking about prolongs. It makes it harder Prolongs. <laughs> we need to do something physical. We need yeah. to take our mind off of these things. Whittle it! I have a question. Yes. We, we brought tools, Whittling tools. to whittle okay. with. Let's see what you have. What do you have, Spoonie? Let's make room for the... <laughs> do you have a hunk of wood that needs a flat top fade? Tell us what So I have do. wood for you. I've heard I that think... in Brooklyn a few times. Hello. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't push too hard. Okay. All right. Just oh, you yeah. wanna... Smooth. It's like a... I am I feel like... drunk. What happens okay, when you get balsa wood in your whiskey? Ah! <laughs> he hurt himself. Oh. Are you okay? I'm fine! He's strong. Yeah. <laughs> He's country strong. Yeah. No. No. What are we making? Or you just do a, a couple little more twists and turns of the night, and suddenly you have. Ah! Mussolini! Ah! Trauma characters! A parade of spooks! <laughs> the fact that he's got his hands in his pocket, that's a cowardly way of saying, I can't carve hands, right? I'm cool, he's but I'm mellow. Fists. I'm dark, but I'm also light. Um, I'm, I'm fearful, but I'm brave. Yeah! What, what I want this day to! Is that everything's going to be fine, fine, fine? Yeah. I got one, one hand in my pocket, pocket and the other, other hand is not called out yet. Yeah. Feedback. I feel a little um, unguided as far as how to make stuff. You just carve it. Like, like we said before, there's no rules. There's no rules. Just be free. No rules, just it's, right. Yeah. Outback Steakhouse. <laughs> How low do you think you'd have to sink as a person to be at an Outback Steakhouse? Oh. Soma, tell us about yourself. We don't what? know you. Yeah. I don't know well, this you. Is what, you know what, guys? Yeah. I feel like this is what whittling is all about. What's the smallest thing you ever whittled and why did you bother? I love whittling. Well, Spoonie! How's this, how's this going so far? <laughs> You're getting blood all over your thing. No, here you go, here you go. Yeah, let's put a, let's make a split. Do you want to know anything Dude, about us? Do we need the first aid kit? Do we have is a first there a first aid kit? kit? I 
feel like we've had enough time to work on our projects, and I think I would like to see what you guys have to offer, what you've been working on so hard. First of all, I want to mention I have sawdust all over my breasts. <laughs> Second of all, I made a, I made a cat. That's what it is. That's no, beautiful. It's beautiful. Thanks. It's a cute cat. I, I shifted gears from the dinosaur and I made <laughs> a I made a little plane, but I, I also made a little dinosaur pilot. Jeez Louise. That's not bad. I made a bottle of <laughs> King Remy the thirteenth. We're sorry about your table. About the table. I I am I feel awful. So I think we learned a lot today. about whittling, about whiskey, and about life and friends. For How Is Your Week, I'm Julie Klausner with Ted Leo and Chris Spoonie Spooner to say, have a nice life. Goodbye! I'm in love with you. <laughs> <laughs>